So a lot of you know what it is I do for Agent of Traction. You know what I do outside of Agent of Traction. I work with insurance agents who want to better automate their business. And a big part of automation for any business is understanding your processes, understanding your data, understanding your audience, understanding you know, how you have an end result, how you get to that end result. And for most insurance agencies, they, the end result is to sell insurance policies. So how can we automate to get from, you know, a potential prospect over to selling an insurance policy? And there's steps, and we could literally do a hundred of these that would last hours and hours or months talking about all of that. But something happened this morning that honestly makes me want to tear a hole in a wall, it makes me want to punch things, scream, yell, Partly out of, part, partially out of frustration, but also partially out of thankfulness that somebody has finally said something aloud. So I don't know if a lot of you are familiar with Neon. That's um, an insurance agency based, I think they're in somewhere in uh, northern uh, Ohio, that they have started a, a smaller, I'll call it subsidiary group called Be Atomic. And what they're doing is they're basically creating a platform to help insurance agents and insurance agent type companies with data, not necessarily automation, but data and how to better utilize their data to be more successful. Um, hopefully if the Be Atomic people watch this video, they're not gonna be mad at me because I've misstated their core purpose. But nonetheless, uh, Sydney Rowe, who a lot of you know, uh, did a video this morning for the Be Atomic YouTube channel um, about something called data muling, which is, uh, unless you deal a lot in d big data or analytics or things like that, data muling is essentially the process of you as the end user collecting data and then sending it up the food chain or up the line to the larger company who then use that data um, at no cost to them for their purposes. So, you know, Progressive does this essentially. They're kind of the, they're the, the leader in this model where they collect the data from the agents and then they are able to use that data for essentially whatever they want. And so what makes me frustrated and angry and upset is that insurance agents don't understand and don't many of them don't care that the data that they are spending so much time collecting because that's the core piece of what they do. If they don't have the data, they can't get a quote. If they don't have the data, they can't give you a price. If they don't have the data, they can't keep the policy. So they collect the data. They do it. Their staff does it. They hire companies that do it. And what they do is they take that data and they send it to XYZ insurance carrier. And that carrier is then able to use it for whatever they want. And they don't have to pay for it. I mean, they pay the commission, but the commission is based on the sale. And in one comment that I read this morning that says that a lot of these companies, they provide a software product. Well, the money that they make off of the data that they are then reselling to people, they make more than that, more off of the sale of that data than they do off of the creation and the licensing of the software, which is just absolutely mind-blowing to me. I mean, and I knew a lot of this stuff, but I didn't have anything to back it up with. I didn't have any realistic you know, data to, to, to prove my point. And so Sydney Rowe in this video, which I've already posted, should does that for me. And so the thing that I the thing that makes me insane is that insurance agents say to me all the time, well, how can I get more leads? Or what can I do to improve my, you know, my business? Or how can I write more policies? Well, guess what? You have an asset that you can use to do all of those things in your pardon the expression, but shitty AMS system right now. Go in there and look. You have hundreds, thousands, hundreds of thousands of lines of data about your clients that you have collected in the most upstanding and positive, best way possible. You have done your job. You are being compliant. You are being good with. You are not reselling. You are using this data for the purest purposes possible, which is to help these people get insurance. And you want to get them a better deal. You want to get them a lower price. You want to get them better coverage. You're doing it right. You're doing everything that you are supposed to do. But guess what? The insurance carriers are not. They are utilizing this data 
for their own purposes, and they're making a shitload of money off of it. And so, in my opinion, that time, the time today that allows you to not utilize that money as a way, utilize that data as a way to help your business should stop today. You can utilize that data and you can help yourself acquire more leads. You can help yourself be a more efficient agency with your processes. And that data, what you have in your management system right now is solid freaking gold. Solid gold. So you are no longer an insurance agency. You are a data collection company that happens to sell insurance. That's what you are. You collect data, and then if you are not utilizing that data, again, in an upstanding, positive sort of way to better improve how you bring in clients, well, that's just stupid. I mean, that is the definition of doing the same thing over and over and over again and expecting a different result. That's what you're doing. And it infuriates me that no one has realized this until finally somebody with a large enough megaphone put it out there. So if you want to talk more about this, if you have questions, if you don't understand what I'm saying, I want you to message me. I want you to call me. I want you to send me an email. Send me a fax. Send me a smoke signal. Send me a carrier pigeon. You can send me whatever you want. Because today is the day where we stop not talking about this. We are going to start talking about this and we are going to start making sure that your agencies are succeeding with the information that you have. Even if it's five people, then that's something that we can start utilizing to help improve your agency. So I am don't get off. I don't get upset on camera or on my soapbox very often, but today was the day. So stop wasting your data. So I hope everyone has a great day. I encourage you 100% to watch this video. It's posted on our group. All you'll have to do is just click the link. So I will uh, talk to everyone soon. Have a great day.